I don't got no intro, so fuck it, it's the intro. Y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be checking out Cash Cobain and J. Cole, Grippy, Audio. This one was suggested by my homie JD. He said, hey, where the music reactions at? You feel me? He been, he been trying to see my reaction to this 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 Grippy song, because, you know, apparently, you know what I'm saying? Apparently, it's a very interesting song, and um, it got J. Cole on it, and, you know, considering the controversy he was just a part of, people ain't, ain't really heard too much. So, it's really going to be like the first song that I've heard since he dropped the seven-minute drill. It's going to be interesting, um, to say the least, just to see what he's talking about. And Cash Co Cobain, I don't think I've ever heard of no Cash Cobain in my life. So this is my first time hearing Cash Cobain as well. I heard of Kurt Cobain, but I don't even know if that, I've never, you know, whatever. That's not the same person. I don't know who Cash Cobain is. First time hearing it. And we got J. Cole. We checking out Grippy. Let's see what the fuck they talking about. She like my kick game. And when you meet on kick game, I put her front row to Nick game. Now she in my phone with a nickname. It's, it's, it's. Yeah. Grippy, yeah. Grippy, Grippy, I call her that cause it's Grippy. She thinking that if she a hippie, and she thinking the lips she gon' lick me, and she sending a flip when she hit me. With a kissy emoji, she miss me. When she see me, she said she gon' strip me. She gon' chew on this stick like it's Wrigley's. Yeah. Believe it or not. Okay, so uh, <laughs> the way I heard about this song, they be saying that uh, J Cole kind of uh, apparently this is the worst. <laughs> One of the ver the worst verses that he actually had. So maybe I'm. I, let me run it back just to like hear it again. Let me just hear. It. It's real simple. If anything, I'm gonna say it's a real simple verse. He not talking about shit. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. This song ain't got no substance, bro. What are you talking about? He said I took her to the game, put her on on the floor side. You feel me? She she got a nickname in my phone, and it's Grippy, cause she Grippy, and she missed me. She so send me emojis. She wanna kiss me or some shit like that, boy. What the hell is you talking about? Grippy. <laughs> Let me see. Grippy. She Run it like back. Kick game. And when you meet on kick game, I put yeah. her road a nick game. Now she in my phone with a nickname. Uh huh. It's, it's, it's Grippy. Grippy. Yeah. Grippy. 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 Yeah. I call her that cause it's Grippy. She thinking that if she a hippie. Mm -hmm. And she thinking the lips she gon' lick me. Yeah. She sending a flip when she hit me. With a kissy emoji, she missed me. When she see me, she said she gon' strip me. She gon' chew on this stick like it's Wrigley's. Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, like Ripley's. She said she was gay until I slayed. Now she's strictly diggly. As soon as she pays, I'm on the way and I'll be showing her quickly. On the highway, I'm doing 150. <laughs> okay. Uh, listen, this is, what I, this is how I feel about it so far. I just feel like people expect it more. You know? Because it's J. Cole. Like, <laughs> yeah, lyricist. I feel like if any other artist made this same exact song, who you didn't really expect the kind of lyricist um, or the level of rap that you expect when you hear J. Cole, um, <laughs> it wouldn't have this like negative connotation. I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> like if 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 this was like just if if motherfucking I don't even know if sexy red said it, y'all probably like it wouldn't probably be this <laughs> this much you know uh rigmarole about it. Like people would just accept it for what it was. Oh, another sexy. They probably fuck with it more. The beat'll probably be a little different, and it, it'll probably evolve like you know some like shaky butt music type beats or whatever. But Huh? He ain't talking about shit though, y'all. That's like, like what is he talking about? I don't know what the fuck Cole talking about. Maybe he said I'm gonna come and reinvent myself. This is what y'all want. Y'all don't want, you know what I'm saying? Cause people say say his shit a little boring sometimes. So now he said I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you something that you fuck with. Believe it or not, like Ripley, yeah. she said she was gay until I slay. Now she's strictly, strictly diggly. diggly. As soon as she pays, I'm on the way and I'll be showing her quickly. On the highway, I'm doing 150. This flow sucks like, too. I gotta get you up out of the Vickies. <laughs> So good, I just had an epiphany. It's gripping and wet. You know I'm a vet, but you're making me feel like a rookie. How you made me tap out so swiftly, but I'm back for the second round victory. I remember I saw you on Fifth Ave with your homie Sabrina and Tiffany. I was thinking like, damn, your whole click bad, but I wanted your body specifically. Specifically, like, I'm trying to see how that specifically. Speci you can't even get the whole word in there, brother. I know you try. Sometimes you gotta break it down like that. Specifically, let me see. I was thinking like, damn, your whole click bad, but I wanted your body specifically. Specifically. Maybe he did get in there. Maybe it just ain't, it wasn't popping enough. Nah, maybe this is another uh, possibility. Maybe Cash Cobain already had the song and he just said, look, I got this open verse right here and I just need you to jump on it. And and he just kind of had to blend it, right? So, you know, given what he was provided, he had to kind of match it and there wasn't no room for the flow to, to, be, to be something else. But I feel like, I don't know. You probably could have this. We're going to hear how Cash Cobain, I feel like we got to blame Cash. Y'all can't blame Cole. I mean, you can blame Cole because he put it out there, but like, Cash might be responsible, bro. You might be the, the true villain, bro. You forced his hand. He really ain't have a choice with it. Let's see. 
I saw you on Fifth Half with your homie Sabrina and Tiffany. I was thinking like, damn, your whole click bad, but I wanted your body specifically. Mm-hmm. Specifically. Like, I'm trying to see how that glove gon' fit me. Mm-hmm. What? Like, I wanna feel like I'm touching your kidneys. Yeah. Like, bitch, I'ma send all your kids to Disney. Mm-hmm. I'ma pay a little extra, make sure they meet Mickey. <laughs> she what? She what? She a grippy. She, she a grippy. grippy. She what? She a grippy. Let me hear I'm trying to give you the best of me. I wanna get it like recipe. See on that pussy like it was a recipe. Like, Shanti, I wanna make you a mommy. You look good as a redhead, redhead, black hair, pink hair, blondie. Like, mommy, sorry. I'm trying. What would he say? Shawty, I'm trying to make you a, a mommy. You look good as a dreadhead, redhead, something blondie. This is your fault, bro. This is your fault. You're responsible. I'm not gonna blame. I, like, but like, this is the point I'm making though. You hear Cash go bang going, you just like, okay, you know, like. It just sounds like that's his his vibe. You feel me? Like that's it's it's not that shocking. It's not that like, oh my god, I can't believe this is the song that you're making. It's like, oh shit, Cash Cobain going crazy. You know what I mean? It's just not for Cole. It's just it's just not for you, Cole. Like, I ain't gonna pause no more. I'm gonna like, make you a go ahead, bro. You look good as a red hair, dry hair, black hair, pink hair, blondie. Like, sorry, I know I be on your body. Not yeah. Like sorry, but you a hottie. You let me hit up a bust a shellotty. Like damn, me what uh, I can not Sorry, I know I be on your body, not make this higher, but you a hottie. You let me hit up a bust a shellotty, like damn. Me, I cannot wait till I see ya. Yeah, I cannot wait till I eat ya. You got a nigga that I wanna be him, like damn. Jada, you know I would never be. If you got a nigga, then I wanna be him. But she got a nigga, so how can you be him? Wanna be another nigga? You should just say you wanted to be her nigga. That sound crazy, but you feel me the flow going? I know I like each other. You got a nigga that I wanna be him. Yeah. Like, damn. Jada, you know I would never play her. Mm. Can I put you on my face, love? I want your pussy now. I want it later. Like, Kayla, got a body like you waiter. Can I put you on my face, love? That pussy cream and call you mashed potatoes. Like, Chinese Chick- and cream and call you mashed potatoes. Is what do you say, Kayla? What? Got a body like you waiter. Can I put you on my face, love? That pussy cream and call you mashed potatoes. That like, pussy cream and call you mashed potatoes. <laughs> you got that good up with Jada. I, I got a fire. I got a hit one more time. I'm a Maya. Hey, damn. Naya, you the quiet, you the shy one. I wanna mm, have a minor. Fuck that. I want pasta in your vagina. Hey, damn. Tony, I know that shit macaroni. I wanna be more than homies. Give me that pussy. Don't be acting phony. Like, Oni, you the opposite of Boney. What did he say? You push my business off like a party. Can't get these niggas off for your body. I want to put it all in your body. body. Wanna get in your drawers till my dick is off. Let my dick Wanna off. get in your drawers till my, my dick is off. Till my dick is off. What? It's all for your body. I got a different talk. If a nigga say that he don't want you, then he gets slotty. Like, damn. Grippy. I must confess, I want to see you get undressed, for sure, I'm about to see you my address, mm-hmm. I ain't gonna lie, Cole still got the toughest verse on this, <laughs> Cole verse still better, mm-hmm. and when I talk, I'm just figured out, can't forget about, Milly, I want to fuck your body till you dizzy, want you to suck it sloppy, make it spitty, I'm about to call your phone, so come get with me, no you don't drink, can you save me, I want your face, you so pretty, I got a thing, for your tits. I want to eat your body like a 10 piece, damn. I want to eat your body like a 10 piece. Okay, baby, for sure. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I kind of understand why Cole had to do what he had to do. Like, she like my kick game. And when you mean it on kick game. Cole verse still tougher than his, bro. And I feel like, like I said, I feel like, uh, like, I feel like Cash had the song in mind, right? He already had it. And it went one way because, like, if you listen to his verse, he really just addressing a bunch of different women and saying, like, you know, 
they got that that good good and type shit. So then he probably provided this to um J Cole, and uh he he heard the verse and he probably okay. So like the consensus here is she got that grippy. You feel me? So he kind of just you feel me. That's his. That's his. <laughs> that's his substance. It's just not normal for J Cole to speak about. Like, I mean, he we he does, but like not the whole verse. You feel me? Not the whole verse. You you know. But it's a feature. But then he then his song's called Grippy. So is it a feature? Whose song is this, y'all? It's both of theirs. It's and it's not a feature. I'm trying to understand it. I'm just trying to understand it. That's the only thing that I can I can make. That's the only way I can rationalize what happened. Cash Cobain had a song. And he had his topic and his substance, and you know, what's gonna be the, the song is gonna be about. He sent it to Cole. Cole heard it, said, "Okay, I understand." And he had to do the assignment. You feel me? He had to do what he had to do, and that's what we got. Y'all, Cash Cobain, J Cole, Grippy. Let me know what you think about it. Is this J Cole's worst verse? Mm, I mean, I never heard nothing like to. I I can't tell you another song that's like. This, this, I feel like people dragging it too a little bit. Like it's it's not his best shit, but it's not like like ass. You know, it's not like oh my god, this is the worst shit I've ever heard. I can't listen to it again. At least it's catchy. He got the creepy. Like, you know what I'm saying? At least it's a little catchy. The beat look. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go ahead and end the video, man. Y'all tell me what y'all think about Cash Cobain, J Cole, Grippy. Let me know how you feel about the verse. Do you think he, he should, maybe he should have never made the song? I don't know. I don't know. Y'all have a good day. Like, share, subscribe. If y'all want more Cash Cobain, more J Cole, let me know in the conversation. Peace out.